night on the hour cameras were rolling as a man and woman were put in handcuffs accused of following a bank customer and robbing him. It's a crime known as jugging. Officers arrested Christopher Alexander and Jacqueline Hawkins in a nearby pawn shop. Channel 2's Keith Garvin live now in Rice Military where all went down. Keith? That's right, Dominique. The pair arrested in this parking lot today are no strangers to crime, including the so-called act of jugging. The reason police want people to see their faces is because they believe they could be connected to even more crimes. Today was not a good day for Christopher Alexander and Jacqueline Hawkins. Officers with HPD and DPS arrested the pair in a pawn shop parking lot in Rice Military after police say the two followed a customer from a nearby bank and broke into his car to steal the cash he had just withdrawn. It's the type of robbery referred to as jugging. Although both were somewhat shy around our cameras, they eventually posed for mug shots at the Harris County Jail. The two have been down this road before. The male suspect's currently on bond for possession of a controlled substance and for felony evading. And the female uh, admitted to our officers on the scene that she's been jugging for a while now, has committed several more jugging cases. In fact, police tell Channel 2 Alexander and Hawkins have very lengthy criminal records. Mr. Alexander was arrested on that drug case just this past Monday. He's been charged with 14 felonies since 2010. Ms. Hawkins is currently on parole after being sentenced to 15 years in prison on a different drug charge. She's been arrested nearly a dozen times for felonies since 2002. Most of our people that we're catching uh, for jugging are repeat offenders. They are being arrested, they make bond, and they're committing more crimes while on bond. Police charge Alexander and Hawkins with felony theft and also burglary of a motor vehicle in relation to today's arrest. Officers also say that both were in possession of narcotics at the time of their arrests. Reporting live from Rice Military, Keith Garvin, KPRC Channel 2 News.